Welcome to our house introduction video. Wanted to give you a little picture of what it looks like downstairs outside or in our neighborhood. Here is the mountain behind where we live where we get to climb up sometimes. You can see lots of cars. Um, the building we're in is really tall. Well, I mean, you know, not really tall, but like actually seven or eight stories we're on the third floor. That one right in the middle right there, that balcony is actually ours, but it's not really important. If you came to our house, you'd come down the street and come right up to this door here. And to get in, you have to push 301. You wait and wait for somebody to open it. Is it open? It's open. Huh? Here we, yes. Here we come into the stairwell where we live. If you go down the stairs there, it goes to the garage area. We got to go up a couple flights of stairs here. So here's a, on every level in this building, there's a couple different homes. There's one, there's another. We're up on the third floor. Now. No. And here we are. Somebody's here to welcome us. Hello, can I come to your house? Can I come to your house? Yes! Okay, here's what it looks like coming in the door of our home. There's two welcoming faces walking into the living room area here. Let me just give you a view of the living room real quick. Contrast. Okay, and then from the living room here, we want to give you a little view out into one of our favorite things, which is Jude's going to tell us about. Jude, what is it called? Back Porch Cafe. Back Porch Cafe. Here's where we got some pet fish. Okay. See that beautiful clear water? Yeah. It's a good ecosystem though. We got snails and plants and fish going there and somehow they all stay alive. And we also put a grill here to grill stuff. Mm -hmm. A little base though. Well probably yesterday we did. Okay Jude, do you want to tell talk about what we can see? I'm gonna show them what we can see from Back Porch Cafe and you tell them about what we see. You can see that this road that, that goes up there. And it goes to a place that we call the coffee shop. Mmm, yeah. Then we can see all these trees. Yes. Right? It looks so green to me. Except yeah. It has a little red flowers. This is, we can kind of see down into town, but not the main downtown part of where we live here. And there is a swimming pool, except it's empty. That's right. What do we like to do at Back Porch Cafe, Jude? Eat. Eat what? Food. Food. Popsicles. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's go back in. Tomatoes. We'll go back in and. Oh yeah, Max, tell us about these. Tomatoes. Yeah. All our other plants. What happened to all our other plants? Dead. Yeah, but tomatoes lived. Okay. Now, Max. Now you. As you come back in, on the right there you see the door that we came in before and straight ahead, straight ahead to the right is the kitchen, straight ahead to the left is the schoolroom. And straight in front of you is the dinosaur. Ooh, cool. Hello. Oh, I need to show you a few things before we go there. First of all, these are our beautiful windows that we picked up for not too much. Um, very, very nice touch. 
Here's another one right here. Oh, just love those windows. There's the flying dinosaur. Flying dinosaur! Here is... Okay, we're not there yet. We're not there yet. Sorry, Kimberly. Here's our clock. It's got lots of pictures on it. Well, come here. You want to talk about the kitchen? No. This is... Oh, I am Okay, this is... Kimberly's little display of dishes and things here in the kitchen area. There's our table and the fridge. And there's our kitchen that that window looks out on the area that we came in that I came in the door downstairs from. There's our microwave and oven and water machine thing. There's the dinosaur that just shows up everywhere. <laughs> Okay, let's go see the schoolroom next. Okay, Max, enough dinosaur for now. Let's let mom tell us about schoolroom. Okay, mom, here we are in the schoolroom. Yeah, it's not there. That's not there. Okay. Um, I don't need to say a lot. This is Jesus. No, you didn't, Dad. All right, you mom. Mom's telling us about this now. This is Jude's desk. You want to sit at your desk and show them what a good schoolboy looks like? Show them. This is Max's desk. Great. These are, this is what I use to do my schoolwork. I have school pages. Cool. There's Kimberly's desk there. And I also have a big, huge school notebook, but I'm not quite you sure if I know where it is. Mom, could you give me a school notebook? Here's Max notebook? at his desk. A dinosaur at yes. his desk. Do you want to say anything about your desk? My desk has a map on it almost every day. Yeah, the other side of the map is more what we're doing now, Max. Okay. And Mom? here's the here is the library. We don't have a library, so this is what we have. This and all the books in the boys' room, and we're very blessed. But you know, we don't have a library, so <laughs> it may look like a lot of books, but it's all we got. Out back, quickly show you the back balcony. This overlooks the area that we came in from as well. And there's the mountain back there. And uh, the contrast won't quite adjust. Or This is where we do our laundry and dry it out. There's our washing machine. So exciting. This Hot water heater. This is a school notebook I use. Mm -hmm. And I learned how to spell with it. I want to get how to spell. I'd like to learn with you how to spell. Okay. <laughs> this is Dick. Okay. Hello. This Hi. room in here is yes. kind of it's where we sleep when guests come, and it's kind of Dad's office room, and kind of a little bit of the place where things go that we don't know where else to put them. Storage is a nice way to say that, I guess. Continuing down the hall, to the right, we've got a bathroom with a wonderful heart-shaped sink on the outside and wonderful squatty potty down inside there. That's where we shower. And then here we're coming into something Max wants to tell you about. What is this? Our room. Okay, let's just see who lives here by looking at, oh look, that must be Jude lives there. And we've got an amazing climbing boy. Two. Oh my goodness, two amazing climbing boys. Here it comes, Dad. Okay. Okay, <laughs> scooch out of the way so we can go into the room and see. Of course. Scooch. Ah! Okay, no, tell us about what's in here. That's our bunk bed. It's very messy. Here's a game. Okay. Called Minotaurus. If you want to see how to play, it's this maze where you're, and if you're like okay. yellow, you want to get to this first. Here comes the flying dinosaur! Tell us about what's over here on your bed, see? Look at all those cool what? The flying 
dinosaur coming right at you and books. And books. And anything else you want to tell us about your room? Yes. Nice that we can see. shoot things. Here comes something at you. Going back out into the last room we haven't been in yet. Just a minute, I will. Whose room is this? It's his mom and daddy's room. And that's Dinosaur Lake. But the video also had the, the, the train track in it. It did. It did, G. Okay, we've got a window seat here. It's very nice. And a bouncy bed. And a bouncy bed. Wait for a minute and w wait for a minute <laughs> and watch me. That's not something we really do most of the time, but here for the video, we wouldn't want to say mean things on the video. This is our storage often too, is up on top of yeah, our wardrobe. Since we have no closets. And here's a stuffed animal who can jump too. And I can fly, yeah! Here's another bathroom that we've got here. Just it's got a lot of space that we don't get to use. Thank you so much for coming to our house tour. Yes, thank we you. We hope you will come and visit for real. Here, here. Here, here. And if you want Signing to come off, Kimberly. Okay.